this came out of just a need that we realized early on was that even being a, one of the busier centers in the country, we were never going to do the volume that we needed to do. Everyone kind of had the same idea that if we were going to really make a difference in brain tumors, one institution wasn't going to be able to do it alone. The benefit of investing in CBTTC is that it's not just one researcher and one lab and one project. You're helping support literally hundreds of projects. So one of the most exciting things about um, the way we can do research in the present age is really the diversification of technologies and resources that we can bring to bear on very challenging biomedical problems. And for us, ch childhood uh, brain tumors are of the utmost uh, present day challenge for our community. But the challenges are um, ones that cannot be addressed by any single uh, laboratory or institution um, or, um, or any community uh, on its own. So most consortiums, each member of the, a consortium would work um, within itself, uh, but the CBTTC is different in that we provide open access data for researchers across the world. A lot of researchers often say, what's the catch? You know, wait, you're going to give me data for free or I don't have to do much to get to it. Um, so I think it's uh, making sure that our external researchers know that there, there is no catch. You know, our focus, our drive is to help kids and find better therapies and cures by sharing all the knowledge that we have, all the data we've generated and the specimens we've collected um, to, to help them. I think uh, CBDC can give us uh, uh, insight uh, cross total and very detailed plan, that's very important. We can cooperate with each other and we can work very details and with the lead, with the director of the CPC, we can do more, more clinical trials. When uh, five years ago, CBTCC asked to us to join with you, we were very happy about this. We want the same that you want. We want the cure for our children and for your children. The children are all the same in the world and the tumor is all the same. And if, if we work together from Italy, from US, from China, from other partners around the world, we can do better our work. The one thing that I think is very different um, with CBTTC than with other types of consortiums and tissue banks um, and these types of efforts are when you talk to each individual member, whether they are entering data or they are the principal investigator of their institution, um, everyone understands why we're doing what we're doing. I am responsible for coordinating logistics and enrolling families that are interested in donating um, autopsy specimens. It's incredibly meaningful when I talk to the families because this is the, one of the hardest times that they're ever going to encounter. It's unimaginable. What we want to encourage is that we will respect the tissue that we receive from them and will maintain the child's legacy by making sure that we collect everything and learn everything that we can from the donation so that um, so that we keep the meaning in the life of the child. I think CBTTC's history, where we are today, has been made possible by um, the, the patients and their families, and none of this could be possible without them. And I think everyone who is involved, um, we're all grateful and know that none of this could be done without patients and their families. For me, I think it's inspiring just to see so many people from so many walks of life um, getting together for a common goal. We want the same that you want. We want the cure for our children. 